Hey Jason, this is Kosh from Davis Chevrolet in Airdrie. Uh, the Traverse is back down at our on-site lot. Uh, so I just wanted to do a quick walk around video and give you an idea of what the vehicle is like and if it's a good fit, we can go from there. Cheers. She's still waiting to get a couple decals put on so it is a little bit uh, dirtier than it normally would be but to give you an idea of how it looks, that thing looks sick. Being the RS is gonna have the darker wheels which pair really nicely with the black paint. This guy's also got the blackout emblems on it so you can see the Traverse and the Chevy logo there are black. We got the dual exhaust. Uh, there is a cover for this. We just have not installed that yet. All right, man, this thing looks so clean. Taking a look at the back, we can actually see this is the cover right here. So we just need to throw that guy back on so you won't see the hitch. Obviously this is a seven seater. So we got two in the front, two in the middle, three in the back. Uh, these seats do fold down if you do need more cargo space, but very easy to pull right back up, just like that. Coming around here to the second row, we've got the captain's chairs in the middle. Uh, so these are black leather with this red and gray stitching, which looks super cool. Uh, these seats are very, very comfortable and they do move forward for easy access to the back seats. Uh, we do have a couple USB ports as well as a power outlet back here. Um, you know, if you've got kids, you can keep them entertained, plug in their devices or whatnot. And then we also do have individual climate control for the back. So if they, the kids or whoever's sitting in the back wanted a little bit colder or a little bit warmer, uh, they can do that without affecting the front where you guys are sitting. All right, now coming around to the front, this is where the magic happens. We got more leather seats in the front. These guys are power adjustable down here. Uh, we've got a heated steering wheel. We have heated seats and we have this big screen here in the middle. Now my personal favorite uh, feature on the Traverse is this little hidden compartment that we have here. What you do with this is completely up to you, but it is just a little hidden compartment right there. You can put your sunglasses in there, put your wallet when you're not in here. Quite literally anything you want. I just think that's a cool little quirky feature. We don't have that in any other vehicle, uh, just the Traverse. Here is a shot of the dash there. So we have our full in-vehicle information system here, which is gonna show you all the different diagnostic information for the vehicle. We've also got uh, our home screen here, which is gonna show you the speed limit of the road that you're driving on, as well as your speed and your range. We've got the forward collision alert on this guy, as well as your cruise control, automatic high beams right there. Now, another really nice feature on the Traverse, this right here is a camera mirror. So if you flick this down, you get your standard um, mirror view like that but say you have a bunch of people in the back seat or a bunch of cargo and you can't see out the back uh, this right here gives you a shot out the back without anything blocking your view so if you're driving around with lots of cargo or lots of people in the vehicle it makes it a lot easier to see what is behind you well there you go that's a quick walk around of the 2024 traverse limited uh, obviously there's a lot more stuff i didn't have a chance to go over in the video uh, but if you are interested i'm more than happy to answer any questions you have uh, or if you'd like to actually come see the vehicle obviously it's a little easier to get a feel for things when you're hands-on more than happy to go through all the features and make sure that this vehicle is the perfect fit for you and the family but if you made it to this point thank you so much for watching i'm going to leave my phone number uh, and my email in the message i send you again just so you have my contact information and i'll talk to you soon cheers